Thank you, Mr Speaker. The debate this evening, which I was delighted to have secured on bereavement care in maternity units, stems from my own personal experience in this area and further research. I should stress that I am no expert in maternity nor bereavement, but I speak from personal experience. In May 2014, my wife had her 20-week pregnancy scan, where an abnormality was identified. Uh, further tests led to a diagnosis of Edward syndrome. Um, now, whilst I don't want to go into the detail of my son's condition, Edward syndrome is described as being not compatible with life. So we were well aware of the likely outcome. However, our son was clearly a fighter, and he survived full term to 41 weeks, but sadly in October last year was stillborn. Mr Speaker, as hard as it is to tell you my story, it sets the scene for this debate and hopefully gives the House a small insight into the experience of the parents of the 5,000 babies that are either stillborn or die within seven days of birth every year in England. It's difficult at the best of times to talk about death, particularly the death of children or babies. We all hope it will never happen to us, but there must be provision, facilities and trained staff ready, willing and able to assist families who find themselves in this awful position. I will give way to the chairman.